One rod. One rod today, mate. One rod wonder. Wow. It's on. It's on, mate. Alright, we'll start off with the big Another little Timmy. Big bait. Oh, look at the bait busting up over there. Straight off front of us. Taylor smashing them up. Sun's out, clear water. Bit of water up on the flats. Just need a big fish. Oh, it's a big lizard. Yeah. Good work, Livo. Oh, the net's not out. Back, back him off. off, back him off. Just keep steady pressure on it. Yeah, just steady. Oh, it's a big lizard. Yeah, it's a big fish. Yeah, it's a big lizard. 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 Absolutely stoked. There you go, look at that. That's it, don't be silly girl. Good fish. Look at this thing. How's that for first fish of the session? Three inch gulp. <laughs> <laughs> Shrimp mate, I told ya. They eat one. those things, look at that. Limo. Shit, it's just ripped your glove. What? Just ripped your glove. You big hand bastards. They're old as anyway. I don't go through that, will I? No, you'll be right. Just lock on. Sixty-five. Sixty-five and a smidge. Alright, get back in there. Big one for the day. First uh flooded the day. Um, what was the measurement? 65. 64 wasn't it? and a bit, nearly 65. First one of the day, we've only been on the water like five minutes and uh, we've landed an absolute uh, monster. So uh, Liam's found the spot again. He's always a man of his word. He said we're going to be on again today. So, <laughs> um, yeah, she's a lovely girl. Pretty Look at stoked, her. mate. Pretty stoked. Look at her. Well done, mate. Well done.
the old Berkeley match. He's come in handy. Thanks to the guys at Berkeley for sending me that up. All right, I'm going sea drive. Put a fish in the boat. Then we'll go big. We probably won't. See a lot of that snot's pissed off, eh? It's just ribbon weed picking up. Oh, there goes one. Little guy about 30. Right on the edge of that sand, eh? This is the zone, man. See the broken weed and sandy little pockets. Come on, give us one. Come on, you flat bastards. Look at the lies here. One, two. Oh, there goes a little guy. Dead set, about 15 centimeters. I just want to see that first one ghost in it. Oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> Limo, jumping flatheads. Yes. Holy oh, you got him. 40? He's 40. Keep on Oh, he's 40. He's a scoring keeper. There you go, another one for today. Another nice little uh, little flatty. Um yeah, on a little soft plastic. Second one for today, we've only been out fishing probably 15 minutes, 20 minutes, second one on the board straight away. So yeah, great start for the day already. Oh, keep it. We're keeping him. You are? He's, he's, 40. 40. he's 40 mate, he's a dead guy. Yep. Yeah. Another one top. Another one top. Uh, yeah, jamming the esky. Nice one, Livo. All right, last drift of this flat. I'm still throwing that sea drive. It's more of a confidence bait. I just want to get one on the board. You know, at some point, I'm going to come out here and we're just going to throw those big baits. But until I start spooking big fish or getting follows from big fish or refusals on this bait, like I don't see why I need to change it just yet. I'm just going to get runs on the board, you know, get the feel for it. And then one day, get that proper fish on a big one. But for now, I'll take anything on this thing. Really better fish always low tide, middle tide, high tide. If I knew, mate, I'd tell you. Depends what you're doing. You gotta pick your spots for that shit, you know? Yeah. Lower tide, like you saw that edge we drifted along. Like there's a fish every five meters because they can't be up on the top of that flat. But are the big ones there eating or have they been up feeding the whole time so they're sitting there and I'm like, I don't want to eat now, man. Like, yeah, the ripple doesn't hurt. But people say they like the steel shit for this glide bait because once a fish starts following it, you can see the fish. You can see the fish, you've got more time to try and tweak it and burn it and sit it there and make him eat it, you know. Whereas now, like I'm still, you know, everyone keeps saying, you know, once you see a fish or the, the pause or the rip and the letting it die kind of action gets them, so. At some point, I'm just going to have to assume that there's a fish following it, so I'll do that slow roll and just go, you yeah, know, rip, let it sink, you okay, know, see if he's, just assume that he's there, you know. This little bait is a slow sink, you know, compared to those big baits that are slow floating. So if I stop, this thing just keeps going. Whereas those, you can stop and then it'll sort of die and then start to drift up. Put more on this than I have anything else so far. <laughs> like a confidence bait. Keen to just get a fish, mate. That's what I'm mostly keen for. Something. Not something, a flathead. Oh, that was a nasty one. You got hit. Take it, take it. Yes, Livo. Look at you go, man. You picked it, you caught it. Big good one. Two. Back him off. I need to horse him. Hey, right, little guy. Let me through there, man. I'm going to tangle you up otherwise. See a scorer? Yeah. Probably. Yeah. No, he's probably 
Jeez, one. Oh, dude, this is a bit hard. It's taking it, though. It's taking the whole thing and the whole thing. Another little one. Nice little size. Um, he's a bit small, but he's uh, definitely uh, yeah, another one on the ball for today. Beat me, they're beating me. Lippo's beating me, the fish beat me. I'm getting beat from both ends. All right, we've made a move. This fish in a bit of a cut between a flat and the uh, mangrove line. Normally runs dry, pretty shallow on the low. But we'll give it a go. Never fished up in here. <laughs> I love when you can see just waiting for that ghost. Oh yeah, 80 pound life. Wah, wah, wah. Troy White, min repairs. Look at it go. Look at it go, mate. Fix that shit good. Tell you what, if I can't get a fish by, oh, I'd say three o'clock, out comes a three inch golf shrimp. Oh! Oh! Had one ghost in it. About, oh, real pale grey guy. I even had it, I stopped and glided. Ah! <laughs> Oh man, I still pay seeing him. I class that as a fish. <laughs> Last second I caught him right behind it and it was as I stopped it and let it drop back in front of his face. He just didn't want it. I didn't see him spook hard, he just sort of disappeared back into the bottom as I let it sink. There's a few fish now that ghost it and I just can't get that Convincing eat out of them. Yeah, there's a good chance you've got me with that fish, mate, but we'll see. Alright. Let's go. Glide bait and flood it. Here we go. Come on. Oh, upper. Come on now. Back him off a bit, mate. You don't need to horse him. Back him off a bit. They can go. He's gonna chew you up. You back him off. That's it. Take your time. That's it. That's it. He's a good fish, Livo. That's it. See, if he's shaking his head that hard on tight line, man, he'd chew straight through that leader. See, he's got that. Oh no! Don't do that, Liam. What have you done to him? Oh, you just lift up because I've absolutely. I've absolutely cooked it. Don't let his head out of the way. My line's loose. You just keep fighting. What have I done to you? <laughs> That's a shambles. Not bad, not oh shit, bad. I cut your line. Oh. <laughs> I thought it was mine. <laughs> That's what you get for out fishing me. Yeah, that's a good fish, man. We can't hurt her. Yeah, another one for today. Um, yeah, she's another nice one. Yeah. It's not a uh, for today, mate, uh, but it's perfect. Right spot, right conditions. Yeah, another light, nice beauty. Absolutely sensational.
Gotta let her go. She's too good to keep. What a fish. <laughs> You're killing me, Limo. <laughs> Mate, uh, no, happy man today. Happy man. Yeah, yeah, keep it wet. Don't let her go. There we go. It was filming in some crazy blue colour. I didn't see that. Oh, you can't set got the, the tiny off cut bit of line. How's that? We're getting ready to do a release. Limo's dropped the fish and there's about 40 inches of line that he's managed to grab. Lucky I plugged that back in her gob. <laughs> Take that lure out, eh? Because we don't want to send her on away with that. <laughs> How did you manage that? is killing me again man <laughs> man I'll take one that size they've both been bigger than that first one I got on the glidey the first one was a 58 he was easily a 60 he might not have been that 64 but he was a yeah he's a good fish we do still need a few more for the esky though, so feel free to catch a few like small flathead, mate, you know? Flacky around. Just get a fish on the board. Come on. I'll stick it in there, Livo. Go deep, son. Keep it there, keep it there. Shows people that I want to be catching them on. Well, they should know by now. Oh, sorry, bro. Yeah, another one, uh, another nice one. Beauty. Uh, just in the shallows here. Um, yeah, just a bit of a double pop, mate. So I'll call another beauty. Another, uh, call it today. Um, last place actually we pulled a, uh, you know, a few little ones here and there, but it's, it's all quality at the moment. They're uh, all mid uh, north six, more mid sixties at least, most of them today. So yeah, super stoked again. I know that's an esky jam of that one. If it stays alive long enough and we get a few little guys, she can go back. But give them a bit of water. <laughs> Live her, you cheeky f***ing dog! <sighs> hey, guess what? I don't know if you'll get an invite again next time, man. Come on, man, we've had a trip. <laughs> it's unfortunate. Yeah, there's enough there. Just snip it where it's f***ing frayed. I wouldn't risk it. Alright, as much as I'm trying to get fish on the glide bait, I love catching fish, so I'm going to try and get a fish on the board. I've gone to my gold shrimp. Brent's been killing me. i got to turn it around. i got to do something. Should get another one here. Do the weedy stuff come back. Yes! The Brent show. Good one. Oh, he's still legal. He's still a good fish. 
You kidding me, man? <laughs> you are on fire, mate. There you go, another one. Livo killing me, man. Look at this guy. How many is that, bro? It's five. Bloody hell. And that's his smallest. <laughs> I said that had to be another one between here and the point. And I did say that you'll probably catch it. It's a joke. I haven't had one cast come back in without that shit all over it. Oh, what was that? Yep. Oh, again! Yep. Oh, the tiniest. The tiniest flathead ever. On the board. On the board. Oh, on the board. I don't count that shit. Look at that thing. Look at that. Apparently that's a flathead. <laughs> Dude. Right, let's go. Ghost in it. God damn it. Really? I don't think they like that nor'easter either. Nah, last couple casts, man. Oh, he's got one. Livo. Here's the little guy. Flip him. It's another one, a little nice one. And number uh, six for today. Not a major, huge one, but uh, still something. What a joke! Flat at my ass. Jelly really like this stuff, man. It's um, the darker water. Would you stick to like a like a crawl like this, or would you go yeah. to something brighter? Still, uh, these are solid, man. So they silhouette. If you were throwing like a cleary, glittery shit, man, it's the wrong car. Because these are solid, no light gets through. They silhouette better. So even in the dirty shit, they'll see them. All right, we've been blown off the clean water. That nor'east has kicked in, it's howling out there. We've come in back in here and it's just dirty. It's just pumping out brown filth. We're gonna give it a run. <laughs> Livo. We just pulled up here and there's a bloke over the side going, hey Liam, like, hey, who's that? He's like, oh, just a fan. So shout out to old matey in the big black boat. Good to see the boys on the water. Livo's got another one. You know, we're just going to work the dirty stuff. That glide bait and rod's gone away. There's just no clarity left, and I've struggled all session, so just try and knock a few on the head on the flackies. I've either got to go back down there or we need to make a move. This is shit. Right, let's go try and find some clean water, man. Couldn't do it, man. It was way too dirty up in that shallow little, oh, that little skinnier stuff we were in. Let's come back out where we caught fish earlier. May as well, like the water clarity's a lot better. It's still a howl and nor'easter, but we're still out on the water, so yeah, I'd rather give us our best chance of catching a few fish. So we'll do this little drift again, and then probably try one of the other big drains over there. That tide's starting to drop out a bit now, so yeah, we'll see how we go. Go on. Oh, what? I got a. Oh. Damn it. Didn't even get the cameras right. Oh, another one. Look at that puff of sand. Right here. Damn it. I was going to say, didn't get the cameras on. Come up here, raced in a little too shallow and just spooked two fish. I'm going to let them settle. I'm going to go up this side. We'll blow back around, man. They were definitely good fish, those two. Oh, 
think we made a good move, mate, to be honest. Clarity's nice. Still enough water up in here. Oh! Yep, got him. Did you see him eat it? It's a big fish. Did you see him eat that? Livo, yes. Oh, nice. Livo. Nice. <laughs> a big puff of sand and he just ate it. Oh, I backed off. Oh, he's, he's chewing on that leader hard. I backed him off. Oh, I backed him off real good. Oh, that's a, oh. Oh, he is chewing on that. I don't want to go any harder on him. I can feel it just rubbing every head shake. Oh, oh. Stay in, buddy. The camera's definitely on. Stay on there, mate. Let's get that net deep when he comes up, eh? We might get a shot here, man. We... Oh, no. Stay on there, girl. I know a lot of people will say, oh, Hollywood drag, whatever. I backed this off on purpose. I got a good hook set. I don't need to horse it. This fish is chewing on leader. I can feel every head shake like twanging across teeth. I know there's a chance that the hook can pop out because you're not keeping heaps of pressure on, but I'd rather that than getting bitten off. Yes, Livo! That's a, that's a good one, man. That's catching today. That's yes! Yes! <laughs> the spot prevailed. Oh, man! I'm loving it. Keep it wet on it. We'll go into the sand. Look at that thing. It is a real flathead. I've thrown big glide baits for how many sessions now? And a big old girl just decides that three inch gulp shrimp too good, I'll have it. Look at that. I'll get the mat out and give her a measure soon, but that's a proper flathead. That's what I've been chasing on the glide baits, you know? That's what I've been expecting to catch. Just haven't eventuated. Went back to that little three inch gulf shrimp. It just catches, it just does its job. But that, that is a gorgeous flathead. Look at that thing, that afternoon sun on her. So good. Apparently that's a flathead. 